20... What is this? Is it 22 or 23? I'm going to say 22. I don't know. I'm going to say 22, but I don't know. Um, <laughs> we are joined by Hayden. It has been Hello. too long, my friend. Too long. Well, you know. You're lazy. Yeah, we know you are. <laughs> right. Uh, uh, hilarious. Yeah, I am funny. So we've done... Let's run over here. This field has been fertilization with solid manure. Um, we need, we still need to plow up these ones. We own field 30 as well, which is going to take a bit of time to plow, but we will get there eventually. I'll, uh, I'll I'll kind of do one and then fertilize it and then wait a bit and then do another one. Um, but what we've got going at the moment is the combine is harvesting soya beets. Soya beans, not beets. <laughs> <laughs> soya beans that have uh, just come on great demand, so you know that's pretty good timing. Uh, I think they've just come on great demand. Where is the thing? Yes, they have. Oh, well, the great demand is worse than the actual other price. What? Yeah, the great demand is at. 2163 and the other cell area is at 2477. <laughs> How does that work? But the great demands they just come on, it does go up, I think. Uh, right, what do we need to look at? So we've got 25 sheep, they want some water. Uh, these guys want corn, and the cows want a little bit of everything. Alright, so let's crack on. Let's do a bit of everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's collect some eggs as well. What, let's get like 40 pounds for 300 eggs? No, uh What did I get last time? For eggs, I got a fair bit last time. I had a, I had 173 on me, and I think I got <laughs> like... What was it? I can't remember how much I got now, but... I think we'll, uh, I think we'll mow one of these little fields up here for a bit of grass. Well, we, we might do it old school with a little international. Yeah, you can't be old school, can you? No. But the this guy missed a few bits, so I was just tidying these ends of these fields up. But we're gonna put this uh, guy in field three after he's done. But what so, mower you got? Well, I'm using that three, that thing that looks like a bit of a well, actually looks like a topper, but it's uh, acts like a mower. Is it a pack of three? No, it's uh, it's actually it's a topper with three sets of blades on it, but it, it puts out the swath. So I don't know. It, it comes under modes and it actually well it acts acts a bit like a mode. I think it is actually well I don't know. Oh what? Would, I don't know if you oh. count that a mower. Oh, I I'll watch one of your videos. Yeah, you're on episode 23. There's 22 here. No, 23 are we on? Right, I know what's <laughs> on. Right, we kind of need a pressure washer because we can't see. This tractor is, once he gets dirty, this tractor, you can't actually see out of the windows. Which we've never needed anyway, but. Oh, right, I'm going to move this fucking on there. That's a nice setup, isn't it? Well, that International on the much brother. Yeah, it is. She's a bit under the power bands for it, but... <laughs> She'll be grand. <laughs> we'll open the front window so we can see, and we'll open the roof as well, I think. I mean, it is five minutes past six in-game, but... That's always a good time to go knowing. <laughs> Five, five past six in the morning or at night? Night. <laughs> oh, dear. Day 17. Ugh. Cracking on, aren't you now? Yeah. I don't know when I'm. I don't know when I'm gonna actually stop making videos on this map, but. <laughs> it's a nice map. It is. They're, they're, well, I think 
There's like, obviously, there's one or two things that I would change personally, but that's personal opinion. Yeah. It, it, it does actually work as a map. And I know a lot of people enjoy it, and it is, it is actually out for console now as well. So. Yeah. Oh, and plus, it's early. It's early days in the game yet, isn't it? It's not as if it's like. It's, yeah, it's not up against much really. Yeah. All right, so we'll, tell, we'll mow this. <coughs> There's actually a PZ mower out there somewhere. Actually, I know where it is, but. Get it in your mouse folder, so. You remember, like the one we used to use? Yeah, yeah, the one that folds round. Yeah. Side mower. Hi. Cutting well, it's <coughs> cutting well. Oh, just shut me with the The river's outside making fucking noise. Tell you what, we're, we are going out mowing Monday if it stays dry, which is forecast to. We should be chugging Ooh. along, taking that big beast of a fight. Well, the, the five series at least. <laughs> I wouldn't call it quite a beast. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> she is a beast in her own rights. Nah, yeah, right then. It, it, it'd be good for one or two things, you know? It's what horsepower is it? 150. I won't put it on a feeder. <laughs> no, I'd, I reckon it'll be an alright, you know, yard tract, you know, say, livery yard or something. It would be something that you'd top a horse paddock and stack a few bales with. Yeah. Because its road speed is atrocious. <laughs> As you going out of silage, you know. Fucking hell. You'd want about 20 oh. of them out of silage in just to keep going. <laughs> what about um, pulling that big bailey train full of bales that I've got up oh, the car? Oh, yeah. okay, it's no, about you'd, dark. You'd, you'd be down that gearbox so quick. <laughs> I bet Matthew will be watching. Bet Matthew will be watching the video thinking, "Hello, Matthew. Oh dear, it'll blow up." I'll tell you what. It, it's it's quite it's quite a torquey engine, you know. When you to get it to, oh, what I'm trying to say, you know, on hills and stuff, it doesn't it doesn't really lose out power. You know? Yeah. And What's it like when you you know when you're pulling off? Oh, it'll pull off in second happily. Yeah. Hang on. Don't bother going into that good call just yet, otherwise it'll work. No, yeah. yeah. We'll, we'll go into that in a minute. It, it's what I do is I just, I go down two ranges in fourth, and then I just I use the ranges instead. <laughs> I just go up yeah. the range. It's quicker. I do just, it. It's actually quicker than just changing gear. My main range on that massey has got to be third high and it only has four gears I mean it will pull third off third highs four it will, high. it will pull off in Ford in Ford four <laughs> Ford <laughs> but it it really does not like it like you're really riding the clutch to get it to go yeah I mean that mower doesn't weigh much it's just uh, just a big lump <laughs> Tell you what, this mower is actually quite nice. I wouldn't, I wouldn't personally top, call it a mower. I'd call it a topper because it's in the shape of one. You know, it's actually yeah, square. Yeah, I've got it. I've, uh, I've just seen it on this mid. Yeah, I'd call it a topper, but it acts like a mower because it puts the swap behind it. So it's like well, I haven't got unless I got the uh, what is it, the PZ mower, which I probably will, for, and then I'll uh, probably swap them out. Yeah. Saw your beans finally done. We're going to be upgrading this combine to another dominator, but it's two. What is it? Is it a two? Let me just find it. It's a. Oh no, it's a M E M E J A. What? Two oh eight. So that's that's the next one we're going to save up for. Which has got two hundred thirty-five horsepower, seven thousand one hundred thirty liters, compared to the four thousand six hundred of the dominator. <laughs> so it is. It is pretty much like its bigger sister, really. 
I think. Big. Yeah. I think I think that's what it is, isn't it? It's it's like the next size up in the range. Or yeah. Quite a jump up in the range. I don't know. I don't really know classes that well. I loot there. Six mile an hour. Speed and power. That's what I've set it to anyway. Oh, it's doing well. So we're going to make these into grass bales. Just, well, I might actually I'll make these into hay, and then I think I might sell them or something. Yeah. I might put them through the uh, biogas. May as well keep them and store them, aren't you? Yeah. Well, I'm thinking about upgrading the cow words to 50. Yeah. yeah. Really, trying to just crank it up a bit. Crank it. <coughs> but if, I'm going to get a mower for this uh, international because it is nice. Yeah. See if you find that piece. I know where it is. Yeah. I think I'm going to keep it though for just doing these smaller fields up here because it's a bit, it's a bit big to get a. Uh, Trail up a front mower and a side mower up here. Yeah. Trail is a nice. I like the mower out of the coom pack, but it's a bit big, isn't it? It is. It seems quite big for a side mower. Yeah. So if, if we could get Kieran to shrink it a bit, well, if you know. But you'd have to hack the, you'd have to hack the DLC to do it. Oh, yeah, yeah, because it's DLC, isn't it? It's not a mod. Unless you found the modded one. Yeah. Yeah, shrink it down. Reskin it to a PZ. To a grand. Well, I, I know where there is one. There is one about. I haven't actually downloaded it and tried it, so it could be total crap. But... <laughs> Let's see. But doing this, this kind of reminds me of, uh, you know, topping like horse paddocks and stuff. In an international yeah. with a topper on it, a small. Just need a Kabuto now. <laughs> oh god, that's, don't that's apparently meant to be the next DLC with the big bud. After that. Oh dear me. Apparently, that's what I've read somewhere, but I don't know how true that is. You think about me downloads that will get absolute zilch. Oh, I've, I've had a look at some of these comparison videos, <laughs> what John Deere did, you know, some of their series up against the next top sellers, which is Kabuto, you know, in the horses stuff. And, uh, Kubota is, if you read the comments, quite a lot of people prefer Kubota over John Deere. They are nice, they're nice tracks, they just have no power at all. Right, but see, that I was reading a few comments and people were like, oh, it's way more powerful, get the Kubota, it's like it's like two times the power that the John Deere is. But yeah, they, they it really they, isn't. <laughs> they brought one, apparently, before they bought them John Deere's artwork, they had one, they brought one down and they didn't even try it. It didn't even try it because the amount of miles it would have done it, it'd have blown the gearbox up. <laughs> yeah. The the big ones are alright. It's just, you know, the small one. It's not like that one that I was topping with that time. Can you remember oh, yeah. that? Yeah, that thing. That that was alright. All right. Yeah, just... but that that was built to do that job. That thing that thing won't work very hard doing any of that. I mean, so it's, what, it's it was a working. bit back heavy. Oh yeah, it is. You lift that top up. But that, uh, he was only going to be using it, you know, to muck stuff out, wasn't he, really, and a few other bits yeah. of jobs. You only had a few sheep. Yeah, it's like... It would have been great if I had a move there. That would have been <laughs> Internationals and stuff like that. Yeah. Imagine topping in that major with a straight bike. Oh, <laughs> dear me. I'll tell you what, you'd have to have some ear fenders on, wouldn't you? <laughs> you'd have to have earplugs inside of your ear defenders, just, just to listen. <laughs> Put your headphones on full blast. Even then, she'd probably get loud. <laughs> she's uh, she's very off track today. It, uh, for two weeks, when we were moving all them logs, it started every day and it was ran. And I'll tell you what, it starts like a dream. Yeah. You walk up to it, dip its oil, which it never, it's hardly using now. Push the, the cold thing on the button about two or three turns and off it goes. I mean, it still smokes like hell, but. Yeah. And I'm not. Well, I've read a few comments on the 
my videos that people say it needs a complete engine rebuild, but it's like, well, none of the liners have got any, like, marks in them. The piston rings are, are quite springy still. You know, yeah. Worn out. <laughs> well, that's what Slide. They spring out onto the, uh, the liners. Um, the valves seem to seat properly and all that, so I, I can't really see why, how that could be the problem. Yeah. But I, I, I'm sort of looking towards the pump I am. You know, the pump's not... I mean, it, when you ask it to ask, when you ask for power, it gives you it, you know, quick as hell, but... Mm, it's a very nice track, too. It needs and... a lot of <laughs> It's just you being lazy, that is. Yeah. Chipping paint off your horses. I mean, it runs like... It runs... I'm mechanically, I've done a good job, but... <laughs> you are. But all the other bits... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's rear PTO seal is starting to show a bit of leakage, so mm. uh, that'll probably be next winter. That'll be the next thing to be taken off it. Sorted. One day I might. One day I might do it. At once, you know, give it a few years. I might do a complete engine rebuild on it. New balance a lot. Completely gut it and rebuild it. Let's see what that does. To it. But personally, I don't think it is. Um, because it wouldn't... I mean, it only smokes. You, do you not remember that massive we drove? Of course that, I that remember thing. that bloody thing. <laughs> Once you... On tick over, that thing smoked. You give that thing some revs and it didn't smoke at all, did it? No. A few revs and it used... That's, that's exactly the same thing with my major. You turn it on to tick over, it smokes. You give it a few revs and it doesn't smoke at all. Tell you what, Richard made it smoke. No, he did. Chain arrows. Chain arrows were stuck in the ground because he'd re driven over them. <laughs> so we, uh, he'd driven over them with the A340. Anyway, he came to pulling them out with a massly. <laughs> and um, didn't half chuck the front end up. Yep, the sun's out round here, so we're doing alright. Oh, the sun's out down here, it's just windy now. Let me just turn off. Plank rope is off. Oh, that's good. I didn't want I didn't want the crop to start growing back through this middle <laughs> field. Uh, I think we'll go. I turned plank rope off. You know, for like when you've Yeah. When you want to go much spreading. Yeah, normally I'd turn it off until I'm fast forwarding time and I just turn it off. Right? Yeah. Why are you doing three subscribers? Three thousand subscriber special. Uh, people have asked me to do a how to change the veil texture video, which when which I'm gonna do. So don't worry, everyone. Uh, I'm waiting for. Well. I'm going to do a vlog this weekend, so this will be out tomorrow. I'll do a vlog. Well, I might do a vlog tomorrow, like Saturday or something. I'll do a few bits, and then uh, I'll do probably Sunday. Or Saturday. Sunday. Yeah. Right, let us go. Oh, I need to up the speed. We're going to put the tether on, the little uh, hay bob, that's what I'm going to call it, but it has got a really weird name. <laughs> Get some. Uh... This international is quite slow on the road. This is. Oh shit! This is pretty much the same setup as next door. Do you know, the neighbours are just the other side of my driveway. Oh yeah, yeah, in that yeah, shit. Yeah, the international and that topper is almost exactly the same. I just need to put the loader on it. <laughs> put the. Uh... See, does it have a load of rackets on it? Yeah. Well, not, that. not at the moment, no. No, get the load of rackets on it and put that John Deere loader on it. Yeah, the John Deere. Oh, but it slides, that's the problem. I the found, no, I found with this with this mod and that T6 in particular, when it's got a loader on it, you know, you can have the load of brackets, but when you put the loader on it, it slides. Uh, like that, that T6. Disconnected. That T6 is sat. 
perfect, right? I put the loader on it and it starts to move. Hey, tell you what I did the other day. Wow. Absolutely pooed myself. Come, I'd come out, I was milking, yeah. I'd park the mass just outside the dairy so you could see the front wheel was in the doorway. Yeah. And um, I could, because normally you can hear it start and go off if Andrew comes. Mm. And uh, I knew Andrew was like around the yard somewhere. Because I'd come out into the dairy after I'd finished milking, yeah. looked out the door and I couldn't see no front wheels. I thought it had rolled away. So I sprinted out the door and I see him driving around in the field fetching. He was fetching sheep up or something, so I don't know. Absolutely pooed myself, though. I didn't know what to do. I thought the tractor had rolled away. Tell you what, I don't put them John Deere's in part, they roll away. <laughs> what gear stick? What do you. Uh, what's up? I don't know what I'm talking about. You know when you put it in park, do you put it in the park on the gear stick or down? Yeah, yeah, well, um, the handbrake on it, right, doesn't sticks. hold it. No, it doesn't even hold it. Ah, uh, sticks on that, something. You can uh, you put it on and then it, uh, if you're on a hill or something, it tries to roll away. <laughs> like, you can launch it till it's on the last click of the handbrake and it'll still roll away. Jeez. Actually, right. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed. Subscribe more today. And uh, would you like to say anything, Aiden? No, sorry. Happy farming and good boy.